for a, looking for a tie, but I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, you want us to teach you how to tie it? We can do that for sure. <laughs> All of our bow ties are going to be adjustable to your neck size. Put this little anchor into it. Pull it tight. All right, this is one of the few times it's socially acceptable to pop your collar. <laughs> pop it up. Drop the tie over the top. Well, let's go check it out in the mirror. It'll be a little easier from there. So the first step is to make sure that the left side is just about two inches longer than the right as it's hanging over your neck. You're gonna take that longer left side, cross it over the top, and then pull it underneath along your neck. Grab it on both ends, pull it nice and tight, not so tight that you pass out, <laughs> but snug enough it won't move. Then take what's in your right hand, this will be the first cheesy animal pun, leave it on your shoulder, kind of like a parrot on a pirate's shoulder. Now cheesy animal pun number two, you've kind of got what looks like a fish over here outstretched in your left hand. Take your right pointer finger, center it under your chin, and then at the fattest part of that fish, you're gonna fold over the top. So now what you've done is create something that almost looks like a bow. Take that parrot off your shoulder, pull it to the center, and drop it right down the middle. Now, third and final animal, kinda looks like an elephant. <laughs> Take the ears of that elephant, pinch them together over the top of the trunk, and this is where the skill comes in. You've created in the back now this little hole. What you're going to do is take the widest part of that elephant's trunk, grab it in the middle, swing it counterclockwise, so up and to the left, and push it halfway through that hole in the back. So once you get it halfway through, you let it go, you've got what looks like a really sloppy bow tie going. But what you've done is created a loop on the front left, a loop in the back on the right, and that is gonna be how you tighten the knot. Now the trick is, you've got the tail in the back, you can't pull it all the way through that hole we looked at. So pull it out, and then slide the tail back just a little bit so it doesn't pull through. Pull out again, keep pulling and tightening. Every time you pull, the knot gets a little bit tighter, it looks a little bit more like a bow tie. Now this is where you really set yourself apart. You want the, night, the knot to be nice and tight, but it's not gonna be perfect. And that's, you know, a perfect knot is the sign of a clip-on bow tie. You might as well throw on a turquoise vest and a little too much hair gel and go to prom. And you can always do a little adjustment after the fact. But there you go, you got the bow. Grab your collar, fold it down, pop the bow tie over the top. Fix your collar so you don't look like a goon. There you go. Well, look at that. A couple things to remember. You go out, you're gonna get a bunch of compliments on this well-tied bow tie. At the end of the night, for anybody that doubted whether or not you tied it yourself, on your way out the door, pull on the right side, let it go, and just drape it around your neck so that everybody knows I actually tied this thing myself. Absolutely. So there you go. Practice that a couple times, you'll be a pro. Thanks, Nate. My pleasure, dude.